And first to 10, a Michigan State Police Trooper is being remembered this weekend. He was killed by an alleged drunk driver while he was on duty. Thanks for being with us tonight. I'm Doug Reardon. And I'm Ryan Cummings. Our Angela McCall spoke with a relative about his life and how they want Trooper Caleb Starr's life to be honored. Angeline. Doug Ryan, family described Trooper Starr to me as someone who was passionate about law enforcement, but more so than that, a family man who loved his two young daughters and wife more than anything. Caleb was, was a, um, a simple spoken kind of guy with a good sense of humor. Um, he was confident in himself, but, but humble and, and willing to learn new things. Jim Kokenauer met Caleb Starr before he was a trooper. At the time, he was a young man in love with Rachel, Jim's niece. He uh, loved life, loved, loved Rachel more than anything. The couple had two daughters. He was the kind of dad that focused on his family after a long day at work. It was very common for him to come home and just get right down on the floor and play whatever card game they had going on or uh, they would pretend to be something, you know. It was, it was just, they were beautiful family, man. Star fought at the hospital for three weeks after being hit by a drunk driver while on duty in early July. He passed away on July 31st. You can't replace Caleb. It's, it's, it's a hold that will be there forever. During Friday's visitation, you could see a family in blue grieving one of their own, a man who took on responsibility only so few choose. He loved his job. He loved life. He was one of those kind of guys, I mean, that, that, that was looking for a way to be involved, to, to make a difference in life. Trooper Star's funeral is scheduled for tomorrow morning. As for that other driver involved in that crash, she is being charged with second degree murder and other offenses related to drinking and driving. Live in the studio, Angela McCall, Fox 17 News.